Hey everybody, this is Computers All Out here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to make a mod pack. Um, this is for the Technic launcher. Uh, basically, here is the file. It's I'm going to have the link in the description. Uh, it's called the mod pack template. Uh, basically, I set it up for you guys. So the bin, the bin already has the mod pack file. This is where uh, most people are having problems, where it turns out to be a vanilla instead of a modded file. Um, everything else will be blank for mods you know put any mods that you want uh, here are my mods that I'm gonna be putting uh, these are just examples there's like thousands out there that you can have um, you know you got your core mods everything's gonna be blank besides the bin core mods you know it's your preference put whatever you want to put put whatever you feel that's necessary okay so basically let's go get started um, this is when you double click on the file this is what it's gonna look like so basically uh, nothing you don't have to mess with bin uh, config if you're you know if you're an advanced user you can uh, apply some config files for uh, certain mods or sometimes mods will come with a config file okay uh, core mods would be like a chicken core or you know other stuff that's necessary for a mod to run on alright so basically you wanna go to mods and uh, you can download them off the internet you can go to nine minecraft planet minecraft so basically today I'm just gonna install a uh, better furnaces so I'm just gonna copy it here and I'm gonna paste it now that's pretty much it that's the only thing I'm going to uh, you know put for my mods this is just gonna be a little test so basically you wanna highlight all this uh, right click add to archive and here you want to change it as a zip not a rar okay and uh, you can name it anything uh, I'll just name it mod pack test and uh, it'll show up to be like this and when you double click on it it'll be the same thing this is what you're gonna upload to Dropbox or whatever uh, hosting system you use so you can copy that and uh, paste it alright now we'll go to Google Chrome or Internet Explorer Mozilla Firefox whatever browser you use and we're gonna go to Dropbox okay sign in you know I usually sign in and um, okay you gonna press this upload button up at the top uh, choose file and uh, you're gonna go down or you'll uh, pick where your destination was uh, mine's under the desktop and it's mod pack test okay so uh, we're just gonna let that upload while that's uploading we're gonna go to a website called technicpack.net alright now you're gonna need an account to upload your server on here or your mod pack my bad not server alright so I'm gonna log in and uh, we're gonna log in here right and um, we're gonna go to mod pack right here don't click on it yet uh, you're gonna go on to create a mod pack all right we're gonna let that load okay let's go back to Dropbox okay this has one second left let's wait for this to finish real quick all right now it's gonna process and uh, this is where most users tend to mess up on this is important right here so pay attention Alright, so once that once that's done uploading, you know, press done. Uh, you're gonna right click on this, and you uh, you're gonna click share link. Another web page is gonna open up. Press X here. Right click on the download button. Don't press it. You know, uh, click on copy link address. Okay, now you can go here. Uh, your mod pack name, uh, whatever you want to uh, call it. Okay, um, the latest you can do is 1.5.2. Um, short description, uh, and, you know, put anything you want. I agree. Create mod pack. All right, short field is required. Okay, 
Uh, I agree again. Create mod pack. We're gonna let it load. Okay, awesome. So we're gonna click on the button that's up here. It says edit. We gotta edit it one more time. Okay. So where you copy this, you're gonna put it in your mod pack location. Okay. And um, you can put any description you want. Change log permission. Uh, you can add your logo, your background. You know, put what you want to put. So save mod pack. We're gonna allow it to save. All right, uh, pack successfully saved. We're gonna go back to mod packs, and this time you're gonna click on my mod packs. All right, this one is just another test one. You know, it's just for fun. Okay, so you're gonna click on this, and this is the link that you're gonna need right here. So let's go open the Technic launcher. Okay. Uh, you're going to click on add new pack okay and this is where you uh, this is where you're gonna paste your link that technic gave you all right you, now you're gonna click on add mod pack okay now you can launch and uh, just let it low let it uh, put the files on your computer and it should work I mean um, see is if you have this up and running then basically it works Okay, so we're going to let that finish. It'll take a while sometimes because this is the first time it's um, had to put the directories and everything on your computer. Alright, see? This means you have the modded, uh, modded Minecraft. It says uh, 5 mod loaded, so we should be all fine right now. Uh, let's go to single player, create new world. Just to make sure everything works, which it works. Obviously, if you got this far, then you know, everything should be fine. All right, so let's go change our, let's go change our settings real quick. Okay, now everything should be fine. Um, click on, press E, and uh, here you go. Better Furnaces. This is the mod I installed, and uh, this is what I got. Everything works perfectly fine. There should be no problems. Um, if you did exactly what I did, then, you know, everything should work out good. But uh, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, please rate, comment, subscribe, favorite. And uh, if you could, share it with your friends. It helps a lot. Thank you.